Outland fans know Sam and Kate are meant to be each other just like Jamie and Claire in their favorite TV show. Their perfection is not limited to the show, but in every appearance they make their own mark. They are fun, lovely, adorable, cute and hilarious. These are some of their perfect moments in interviews. Hope this video will make your day in this drowland. Here to call, I've been cast in Outlander. What's the first thing you guys did? What's the first thing you did? I did. Uh, when I found out, actually, I was in a, a supermarket or a, a mall, and uh, my agent called me, and I screamed at the top of my voice. And then I went straight to the pub and um, had a few uh, few whiskeys. It was uh, a really good fun. And then, yeah, and then the reality set in of like actually what I've got to do here. My experience is completely different. I was at my friend's house, and she just put her twin babies down to sleep. So I whispered down the phone, I was like, that's great, yeah, wonderful, yeah, great, bye. call you later. <laughs> and then I had a very quiet conversation with my friend about how great it was, because if I'd woken her babies, she probably would have killed me. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah. And if you had one word to describe the first season of Outlander, what would it be? Ooh, an adventure. Yeah, and I think it, a surprising one at that. It, it sets up the show, and, and I think every episode just changes, turns it on its head. I remember him being a very calming influence and, and uh, you know, it was it was very um, helpful when I walked into that room and I was very nervous because he'd already got the job at that point. Yeah, I didn't you care. Know. I was... <laughs> <laughs> You're know, like, who is this chick? No, yes. I just remember we did the scene, uh, we've probably talked about this a lot, but, you know, the scene by the water uh, in season one, I can't remember what episode it is now. I can't remember. Uh, nine. Oh, thank, thank you, you everybody. I'll, I'll go with that. Uh, but it's just a, a very big scene of the book um, and they basically gave us the book to sort of do it was I don't know, like seven or nine pages or something it was, it was a big scene uh, and it got very physical like it tends to on this show yeah. and, and uh, I just remember like she was so pissed off with me for like putting in her a bear hug and that was acting <laughs> I wasn't pissed off I was acting. Oh, that's <laughs> We had a scene the other day, I don't know way too much, but um, we made love, I think, without making love, if you know what I mean. And uh, I, it, for me, that, that's, uh, that's what we were trying to do. Does that and make I, sense? Yes. Yes, it does. Like phone sex or something? <laughs> <laughs> there are no phones. Texts, a lot of texts. Oh, right, sorry. <laughs> Emojis. Uh, <laughs> But between the two of you, as people, you're getting to know each other better. As Sam and Katrina, have you found that you've learned something, even though you know each other so well? I have learned he's a ridiculous human being. A rid <laughs> well, I think you knew that earlier, though, no? That's true. <laughs> but recently, no, have you learned anything about each other that might be surprising to others? <laughs> I t well, I think it's just we, our friendship is, like, we been working so closely alongside each other now for six years and it is true. The first. Arriving in a new country and you know generally people when they arrive somewhere they retain so much of where they came from it's that way of bridging that gap of who you were and, and this new place that you're in so I think you know certain things were different like our costumes were different and the materials that were used were different and that had a bit of a change but you know, Jamie and Claire are still the people that they are. Um, but they, they are affected by the land and I think there is a great positivity and a great freedom here and for the first time you get to see these characters settle, you know, and we're, we're constantly dealing with the drama in, in previous seasons of, of sort of trying to, you know, trying to find each other or trying to find a place to stay and, and here finally they, they find that and the, the land of America seems to be a very very positive place for them. I mean, there's a lot of danger, obviously, but yeah, they're together at least. Okay, favorite Scottish food? Haggis. Favorite TV show ever? Outlander. Oh, <laughs> succession. succession. <laughs> <laughs> favorite film of the year? Oh, oh Beat. Uh, Joker. Laurel and Hardy. Uh, favorite piece of technology? Phone. Motorbike. 
I don't know why this came to my head, but this little thing that chops your veg for you. <laughs> what kind of veg are you chopping? It's really good. You just put it in and zap it. Not and a sterilizer. No, no. no. That is the most different I don't know why that came to my head. Uh, and last one, go to dance move. Because you all talked about being on the dance floor later. Well, kick and step. <laughs> kick, and kick and step. Should we do the kick and step? Kick and step. Kick and step. Kick and step. There we go. Guys, thank you so much. Thank you. And um, enjoy the rest of your evening. Good luck. So, Good luck, everyone. Such a pleasure to meet you all. See you soon.